Okay, quick recap, because this conversation got very scientific, and I think some of the nodes on my brain started to fry while we were talking. But from what I understand about the magic behind the wave source, wave generation systems typically fall into two categories. Electromechanical, which means they use electric motors and gears to drive paddles that create water motion. Or pneumatic, which relies on compressed air to create water motion. The wave source is a reinvented pneumatic system. The difference from legacy pneumatic systems is that it functions by releasing air to create a water drop. The wave peak is powered by a natural rebound, so they only use energy for the drop. The design allows the wave source to use half the energy of legacy pneumatic pools. For electromechanical pools, these typically have an advantage in energy cost over pneumatic systems. However, this slight savings is dramatically offset by the costs associated with their complex drivetrain, which requires higher upfront costs, scheduled maintenance, and potential mechanical failures. Now, I think we have a better understanding of how the wave source is keeping the financials as low as possible. <laughs>